have actually did it. Welcome to the part 19 part where we are finally assembling our parts but before we start let's open our folder and I'm gonna copy mm, I'm gonna rename this T-Post to a uh, no, copy this one paste and name it as a small bracket so let's make a bracket with this part so delete these features here until they are all deleted and in this body feature let's find our bracket is it here yes it is so clear selections and let's delete all bodies except this small body it's our bracket that's how i call it okay and we got it save and let's proceed to assembly this been this has been a long journey and we have finally get to the finish line for a start let's finish uh, let's import body left and right what I'm going to do is to mate planes so front plane mate with front plane on the oh yeah I forgot uh, first I have to right click, we have to right click and make it float so now front plane mate with uh, front plane the part top plane with the top plane and right plane with the right plane ok assembly ok let's save it as assembly import next part body right so again we are assembling front plane of the assembly with, pa with part planes and the right with right click ok I think everything is cool by now next I'm gonna put hmm, let's put cable and heater in because they are inside so again made plain No, 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 sorry. Right, no. Fuck. So, right and right. So, it's, it has found its place. Let's see from the front how it looks like. So, you see this edge and this one, they are, I think, almost in a perfect line. That's why we did the loft here in the previous part is it touching? no it's not ok save and proceed to next one I'm gonna put um, hmm, light glass let's finish these small parts first so planes front and front top with the top and the right with the right it looks fine hmm it doesn't look look fine 
it's not perfect something is not perfect here who cares it's not visible from the outside insert next one I'm gonna put bracket And again, front end, front, what the hell? Oh, well, yes, front, oh, this was glass. So, bracket, front and front. So, and so. And the right and the right. Let's see, is it okay? Yes. It's in the place. And we got left, I, I think, two parts handle, cover, and lid, and we're done. So, let's first put handle cover. And made it again, of course, using planes. I think now for the lead, the assembling is going to be just a little bit different. <coughs> So insert a uh, lid, okay, and let's make only right no front of assembly and front of the lid and second relation is going to be this one so select this face click mate and click on this cylinder okay so what we achieve with this mate is that we can rotate this a lid like in real life so you see this is how it really works <laughs> Yeah, this is normal because it should click inside. This is how it has been made. I'm gonna click escape and undo. And undo until last move is done. And there is one thing left. <laughs> because the bracket is not here for no reason. So uh, assembly features whole wizard select this type of straight step uh, okay standard is ISO and it's a bottoming tapped hole size M2 dimensions are 7 and 6 So 7 is the hole and 6 is the treat, with treat call out and we are not going to use all components so deselect out, select and select only what uh, the only bracket and this body so it's uh, I guess right right side and position 3D sketch is on this space and here and now click escape select this edge and this point and make it concentric and same here make concentric okay okay 
and what's left to be done is is to add so I'll go to office products and select SolidWorks toolbox so that you can load the right here in smart fasteners okay so selection is this one add So the one we are looking for is ISO 7045. Let's try change first and time. Let's try find it. Wow. ISO 7045. It's an add hex. Mm -hmm. 74. Okay, here it is. Pan head cross recess ISO 7045. Okay. So this is how they are looking like. It's a standard for for these screws, and I guess you have seen them sometimes somewhere. And the length should be. Six. Okay. Uh, my sidewalk screen is not so well. I can't see anything, but I'm gonna click OK. And that was that was everything for for assembling. Now we can do some painting jobs. Uh -huh. Okay. Light glass should be glass, of course. And fasteners are okay, but let's open a uh, cable and heater. So we are going to add uh, sweep. Where is the sweep? Here it is. Here it is, and the loft. They are going to be uh, rubber made. And this whole section should also be made rubber. No. So everything except this one. Okay. <laughs> Sorry for this. Make rubber. Well, this fillet is actually not black. Okay. And these these cuts should be metal, metal. So put something like that, and this should be something like light, red LED, red lights, Tiesto. 
and what's left? The left thing is these. They should be something like red color or green or yellow because we want to separate it if we want to import it in a key shot which we can do I could make one widow also of the rendering job to show you how I would do it and it's it's important here that this this is something like metal from because of reflection okay this should also be made rubber and I guess that's it not so visible <laughs> I'm gonna change this color to some lighter like this one perhaps okay this is perfect so I hope you enjoyed this should be the end if I see you are interested I can do also rendering which should be one amazing video hope you guys enjoyed and see you in my next tutorial I don't know what it's going to be but I hope it's gonna be soon